In spite of the fact that the iPhone 15 Ultra and iPhone 14 Pro Max may seem to be identical up close, the Ultra should feature a new, Kuvia design with titanium side rails. On the Ultra, the mute switch from the iPhone 14 Pro Max could be replaced with an action button. When compared to the A16 silicon used in the iPhone 14 Pro Max, the new A17 Bionic chipset should dramatically enhance the power of the iPhone 15 Ultra. The iPhone 15 Ultra's zoom may be increased to 6x with a periscope telephoto camera. The 3x capable iPhone 14 Pro Max is capable. The USB-C connector on the iPhone 15 Ultra might replace the lightning charging port on the iPhone 14 Pro Max, enabling quicker charging and data transmission. Given that Apple is ready to reveal a new batch of iPhones, a comparison between the iPhone 15 Ultra and iPhone 14 Pro Max is very intriguing right now. Tiwi may have to wait another two weeks or so for the Apple September event, but we already have a good sense of how these two phones could compare. According to rumors, the iPhone 15 Ultra will replace the iPhone 15 Pro Max as the flagship model in the iPhone line. There will still be commonalities between the phones despite the fact that some enhancements have been predicted in comparison to what we saw on the iPhone 14 Pro Max. The iPhone 14 Pro Max is now ranked second on our list of the finest smartphones. If the rumors we've heard so far are correct, the iPhone 15 Ultra should replace, if not completely dethrone, the Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra as the greatest phone available.